Side, no, and not taking that contact from Anthony Scarato. Here's Corey Sheath with his first carry. Off to a great start. Over 400 yards rushing and seven rushing touchdowns. Gets tackled there by Josh Hull. Our start to answer those questions in today's ball game. Here's Sheets on third down and one, and he appears to have the first down. Take advantage of all you can get in this game. Corey Sheets, who the coaches say is doing a much better job protecting the football. But most recently was the head coach at Eastern Kentucky. Purdue with excellent field position. Corey Sheets on first down. Can't get to the outside. Spartans only lost this year at Cal on opening weekend. They run Sheets here on third down and short. I don't think he got it. To be alert for the tight end pulling around. And Purdue already converted on a pair of fourth down tries. Josh Hall makes another tackle on Corey Sheets. Sheets actually got positive yardage. But a lot of the kids he recruits will be, uh, their parents will ask Tiller about what Tiller can do to get them into the NFL. As Sheets is very close, appears to have the first down. Nebraska tonight on ESPN at 9 Eastern time. Here in the Big Ten, Purdue trailing Penn State. That's the best running play by a back today for the Boilermakers as they beat a number six team was in 2000 on route to the Rose Bowl and they knocked off Michigan. Sheets to the outside. First down and more. Pushed out across midfield by Tony Davis. Curtis Painter and that Purdue spread offense running play sheets and he gets nothing planted immediately by Tyrell Sales. Two huge missed field goals in the first half but sheets with a big run. That's exactly what Purdue needed. Their first significant play on offense today to the 44 yard line. Well we talked about the Here's Sheets again, nothing in between the tackles, tried to take it outside and then stayed all over it in 2005. Painter trying to hit Sheets out of the backfield and the pass off the mark, incomplete. Boy, you, you know. Here's Sheets on the run and he powers to the 10. Not really not a signature win under his belt. Uh, throughout his career up to date. Maven coming from behind with a pass is thrown that way and Sheets with one man to beat. Down the sideline, now cuts it back upfield and has the first down to the 35. One of those under his belt already as he tries to move this Purdue offense. Here's Sheets on the carry to the 40 yard line. Plenty of weapons, uh, plenty of weapons at the, on offense that is and they're solid defensively. Sheets to the 43. Third down and four. Elliott finds Orton for the Purdue first down. Forward progress to the 48-yard line. An injury for Ohio State. Big one tonight against Wisconsin. And Northwestern's road. Five catches for Orton on the day. Pitch to Sheets. Cut back, not there. Sheets goes to the outside. Scarato filling the hole. And no gain there. For him, Elliott. Colorado breaks that pass up intended for Key Smith. Go to Joey Ellie. Sheets on first and goal over the top and in. Touchdown Purdue. These teams. Another quick snap. Painter sidesteps to his left, completes it again. Another receive part of the plate. He is four for four and has hit four different receivers. That's not going anywhere. Corey Sheets dragged down by around his collar. Down here, down to only four this season. Second and five after the penalty alone. And the flat Corey Sheets, the running back. Halliburton, the fullback, Sheets, the tailback. Corey gets it. Big hole on the right side. First down, Sheets up just inside the 10-yard line. The horn that sounds the whistle. Corey Sheets has to reverse field. Gets a block from Payer. And Sheets with a terrific effort picks up a couple of yards on the play. Brandon Mosley. Sheets taken down in the backfield. Lost the football. Great. 16 passes and six runs. Here's the 17th pass for Purdue today. Not much of a gain at all for for Corey Sheets, taken down by Matt. So far, Curtis Pino running the offense. Lofts that one up over the shoulder of Smith. Actually, the left tackle. Sheets 
behind Halliburton. Gets the ball, gets the first down. And is stopped around the two-yard line. Corey Sheets loops and is in the end zone. The Boilermakers score again. Second turnover, second recovered fumble for Purdue. Second Indiana turnover. Sheets, who has a touchdown run today, picks up a 38 plays, 27 of them on Indiana's side of the field. That's been the kind of day it's been. Painter has to improvise. Sheets picks up the pass. And Painter hands it off to Corey Sheets, slips a couple of tackles, and spins down to the 11 yard line. Sheets, touchdown, his second of the day. People from across this campus paying their respects. And they all love him. Corey Sheets up the middle for a nice game. Tyler with the three scores. Up again. Corey Sheets out of the backfield. Mm, nudged out by Brandon Mosley inside the five, but third. Sheets running to the right, staying in bounds and going towards the end zone. Sheets looked like he was going to go out of bounds. He cut in and gets the touchdown. The Boilermakers pulled the center. Corey Benton, number 78. You see him getting that block, and there's... Sheets keeping the ball inside the pylon. That's what he has to do because he's airborne. Take a look at the center right here. He's going to pull around, and he's going to seal that on the inside. And Sheets is going to wait for it to happen. He almost throws it into park for a second. Watch him. He's right around here. He's going to stop right there and then wait for that block. And look at that hole that he got there. Also got a big help from his big true freshman guard, Ken Plue. He pinned him outside. Benton pinned him inside. Right there he waits, and then it opens up, and away he goes. Corey Sheets scoring from 17 yards out. He has also brought it in from four yards and one yard. The all Sheets, first down Boilers. Greg Brown. Not much happening for Sheets on that carry. Greg Brown playing his final. 